This is a radiance mask and uh, it's a very quick mask. You can do it in five minutes and you'll get a really, really good result if you're a little bit tired and you need to perk yourself up. And we're going to use spirulina and a little bit of water and this is all you need. So we're going to open it up. And, um, you'll probably get away with about a teaspoon. But we're going to do a little bit more just for the video, a teaspoon and a half. And we're going to use a little bit of water and mix it to the consistency of a paste. So I'm going to do maybe a teaspoon of water, or maybe a little bit more. And, and many antioxidants in this mask. And because it's just one ingredient and it's a powder, you can carry it with you anywhere. So make sure that you break down all of the little clots that form in it. Just mash it all up and have it quite liquidy and you can see the resulting paste. This okay. is our love model and we're going to start applying the mask now. You can obviously do this yourself and uh, it's very easy. And you're going to get a very interesting effect. <laughs> this could be used maybe as a as a free Halloween <laughs> mask as well. So you can leave this mask on for five or ten minutes if you like. If you're doing that, I would recommend that you get a little bit of flax oil and put it on top of your mask. But you can also do this mask in the shower. And if you're doing it in the shower, you don't have to apply flax oil at all because the steam of the shower will keep it moist and it won't crust over. If you're doing it in the shower, you can apply it around your eyes as well. I will show you that as well in a second. So we're going to get the flax oil and um, apply that on. This is to prevent the mask from getting dry. The more moist it is, the better you're absorbing nutrients from the mask. So um, I'll show you the flax oil afterwards, but I'm going to put a little bit on my hand. So just doing this. You can see it gets nice and light. I'm just going to dab it over. You can also use a hot towel over this mask if you like. It doesn't really matter. And the flax as well has a very nourishing, a very nourishing effect on the skin. So this is not necessary, but if you would like to do that, you can do that as well. Nice and even now. So, if you wish to apply it on your neck, you can. And the amount that we actually made is enough for nearly your entire body. If you're in the shower, it's very handy to even just place it on you. So, okay. um, if you're in the shower, because there will be a lot of steam, you apply a very thin layer of spirulina around your eyes. Like this, make it more watery. Otherwise, it will start to crust over and it will tighten the skin around your eyes and you don't want to do that because it's not a permanent tightening, permanent tightening effect. The reason why it's not good is because it will keep on always stretching your skin and creating wrinkles under it. So you want it to be quite thin. So, that's it. So, you can be alright if you can. <laughs> this is what it's going to look like, <laughs> but only for about five or ten minutes. And if you're in the shower, nobody's going to see you at all. So basically, get in, put that on your face, wash yourself, and then wash your face at the very, very end of your shower. Even if you have this mask on for three minutes, your skin is still going to feel and look very, very different, and you will see it yourself. 
this is our beautiful model after the mask and um, how do you feel? How did you find the mask? It's great. It's really soft and really nice. Okay. Excellent.